Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get three two-player packs um, to try and pack you guys uh, selves a team of the year for under 1,000 coins from the new weekly objectives that EA did drop. So you guys, if, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys leave a like on this video. If this does work and you guys, if you guys enjoy like these little cheat hack things on uh, FIFA, make sure you guys leave a like on this video. If we could hit 80 likes on this video, I will drop more of these types of videos. Uh, subscribe if you guys are new turn on post notifications if you, and the first three comments on this video will get the shout out for the next video since i haven't posted in a little i'm not going to do a shout out for the last video so if you guys want the shout out for the next video just make sure you guys subscribe turn on post notifications leave a like on the video first three comments on this video will be the shout outs for next video so make sure you guys do go ahead and do that and yeah let's get straight into this video so as you guys can see here ea dropped three weekly objectives uh to go along with team of the year and there's an attackers one a midfielders one and a defenders one for each one you pretty much need to buy for the attackers one you need two you need to buy two attackers using buy now for at least eight thousand coins each for the midfielders you have to buy three midfielders for at least seven thousand coins each and then the defenders you have to do buy two defenders for at least six thousand coins each so unique rigor, riggers on twitter found the perfect players to go ahead and buy and then you literally can just sell the players off and you can end up just getting three two player packs for under 1000 coins you will lose a couple of coins from tax but you're getting three two player packs uh to try and pack a team of the year so for the attackers one you're gonna want to go ahead and try and buy an insigne he's the closest player to like 8,000 coins exactly so go ahead and try and snipe an insigne as you can see here he's like 8.2k if you want to pay 8.2k it's literally 200 coins above or you can just wait and try and snipe him for 8k you can't buy and the bad thing is you can't buy him below 8k so if there were snipes like that to come up you can't actually buy him because it won't like trigger the weekly objective thing so we're just gonna go ahead and buy him for above 8,000 coins right here I'm fine with paying that I'm I just want the packs so we go ahead and buy him for 8.2 the servers are really laggy right now by the way so we'll buy him for 8.2 K there is one um, so send him to the transfer list and make sure before you uh, end up selling your Insigne, make sure you go check your week, the weekly objectives and make sure it shows that you have one of the two bought. So if you go to attackers for me, it says one out of two. So pretty much just go ahead, sell the Insigne, which I'm gonna sell for 8.1K. I'll lose 100 coins. And then once he sells, I'll be able to just go ahead and buy another Insigne. So there we go. We lose 100 coins on this Insigne. We go ahead, buy another one for like 8.1, 8.2K. We'll buy that one for 8,000 exactly. And we have the attackers one complete. So pretty much we're gonna go ahead and do this for each one and I'm gonna be showing you guys the perfect players to buy. So as you can see there, we com com complete complete the attackers one and we get a two players back and that we probably spent 200 coins on it because we'll be losing 200 coins from uh, tax on Insigne. So pretty much let's go ahead, sell the Insigne we bought for 8,000 and yeah let's go ahead sell this insigne for eight thousand, and then do the midfielders one next which you need to buy three players for at least seven thousand coins so it's a little different than the attackers one um the player we will be buying for the midfielders one will be carrasco so we'll be buying three carrascos so just literally go ahead buy the player sell them and yeah I've, I've spent like 200 coins so far so next player again for the midfielders one go ahead and look up yannick carrasco uh the midfielders one is for three players seven thousand coins i'm pretty sure um let me just go ahead and make sure but i'm pretty sure the midfielders one is three players for seven thousand coins and yes it is so we're gonna go ahead and buy carrascos and pretty much get another free uh two player pack to try and pack a team of the year Crasco's uh, Crasco's actually a little bit above 8,000 coins so I'm gonna go ahead and try and find another player to use and then once I find another one I'll be back so after looking around on Footbin and along the market, Carrasco is pretty much the closest midfielder to 7,000 coins. And it doesn't matter that you're paying 900 over what you have to buy him for because you're just going to be selling him for the same price anyway. So it's not like you're going to be losing more coins just because you're buying him more for like more than 7,000, which is what you have to buy. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and use Carrasco for this one. You need three uh, Carrascos for above 7,000. Uh, he's pretty much going for 8,000 right now. So if I bought him for 8,000 and listen him back up for 7.9 he would sell instant so that's what we're gonna go ahead and do right here so let's go ahead buy our first carrasco 
that is going to be one out of three but do make sure guys before you sell your uh carrascos your um insignes or the defender i will be showing you to use um make sure you do check to see if it ticks off so just in case as you can see there it's one out of three because if you're lo running low on coins like me every coin counts and i'm trying to do this for as cheap as possible to get some free packs for uh team of the year so let's go ahead and sell this carrasco for 7.9 as you guys can see the market is or the menus are real are really laggy right now so it's really hard to like list things up so yeah we'll list that carrasco for 7.9 wait till he sells but as he is selling we can actually try and snipe one because i have right above 7,000 coins right now it, the market is so laggy right now it's ridiculous but yeah hopefully our carrasco does sell so i can pick up another one and while we wait i guess i'll just try and snipe one for 7,000. but um there is the defender after this so make sure you guys stick around for in this video if you guys are enjoying this little like video make sure you guys leave a like uh comment down below who you guys pack from these uh weekly objectives and yeah um so our carrasco sold there we go so let's go ahead and pick up another carrasco and yeah let's go ahead and pick up another carrasco and then we'll just end up relisting it just gonna keep doing this over and over again we have to do this for two more carrascos so that's 7.91 sold so we'll just go ahead and pick up one for 8,000. it's whatever i I'm, I'm just doing this for the video's purpose so helping you guys get some uh cheap team of the year packs Two player packs are actually kind of good, so hopefully I'll be opening up, of course, opening these at the end of the video. So there we go, two out of three for the midfielders, one ticked off. We'll go ahead, list our Carrasco for 7.9 again. We're losing another 100 coins, but it's worth it. We're going to be getting some decent packs for team of the year. So we'll go ahead, list this Carrasco, and wait for him to sell. The only reason we are losing coins is because of tax again, so yeah you will lose a little coins from tax but if you do end up getting a snipe for above the price you have to buy the card for you will maybe end up making profit so it could make you profit as well as you get to some free players to go into your club the packs are untradeable which kind of sucks but i mean if you pack someone sick pack a team of the year ronaldo he'll be staying in your club forever so there we go the carrasco for 7.9 has sold and we'll go ahead and pick up our last carrasco for 7.6 which would be a decent snipe there we go so we pick him up for 7.6 and we can sell him on for 7.9 and we just made some profit right there so if you guys do get lucky you can pick up some snipes um so we'll list that for carrasco for 7.9 and now we have the midfielders weekly objective completed and now we only have the defenders one which i will show, be showing you guys what player to use for that one so let's go ahead and claim the reward for the midfielders one we now have two player packs two two player packs and then we have the defenders one last which we have to buy two defenders for at least six thousand coins and for this one we will be using glick to uh finish this off and yeah so let's go find glick up on the market to defend we just have to buy two glicks for six thousand um and yeah we should be done with the s or not the sbc with the uh, weekly objective right after this get ourselves some free team of the year packs pretty much he's pretty much are right around 6,000 coins. This is like, it do, again, it doesn't matter what price you pick these guys up for because you're just going to be selling them off for around the same price as you bought them for. So it doesn't matter that I'm picking up a Glick for 7.7 .7 when you go when you only have to buy one for 6,000 because it really just doesn't matter. You're selling. The only thing that's worse about buying players that are more expensive is you're going to be losing more coins from tax. But still, it's, you're getting free packs and you're just losing maybe a couple hundred coins from tax. So there we go. We picked up one Glick for 7.9 um make sure i'm just making sure that ea does tick off my thing before i sell uh so we went to defenders one out of two and then pretty much let's just go sell this glick for like 7.7 .7, it's whatever and then yeah once this glick sells we'll pick up our last glick and we'll be getting our last free team of the year pack from the weekly objectives i mean it's not pretty much free it's for like under a thousand coins a thousand coins it depends really um how cheap you guys pick up these cards that you're buying for the weekly objective so right now i'm just picking them up for what they're going for but if you guys can get a snipe you'll be making profit and everything like that so yeah we just need one more glick 7.7 .7 right there we'll pick that up it's really hard to snipe right now with the market so laggy so there we go we have the uh weekly objective sub completed so we'll just go ahead list this click up we don't even need to put them on our transfer list without listing so we'll go ahead list them up and yeah hopefully he sells and we'll see how much it spent we spent in total to get three uh team of the year two player packs right here so in total i think we spent around two thousand coins for three two player packs which are actually pretty good they include two players and one of them's rare so it kind of sucks that only one of them's rare but i mean it's, it's just good easy packs i spent two thousand coins 
and yeah so those are the players you guys want to use for those uh the attackers one you want to use insigne the midfielders you want to use carrasco and the defenders one you want to use glick so let's go ahead open up these packs what if we could pack something sick that'd be that'd be crazy all right so first pack oh my god no boards uh let's see what we get here all right if it's no boards i'm just gonna skip the pack we get these are all untradeable again guys so you you just pretty much send them to your club um so let's open up the second one hopefully we can get at least one board from these three packs that'd be pretty sick no boards again so i'm just gonna skip come on yeah come on yeah we got marcelo if only it was the team of the year one all right and for this last pack we're gonna open up a bronze pack before it hopefully get some good luck from opening up the bronze pack and yeah we're gonna pack a team of the year right here watch this watch this the bronze pack luck you open up a bronze pack quick sell it and then you open up a pack you'll pack a team of the year come on yeah hook us up we don't even get a board sad times sad times but i mean i have awful pack luck so you guys can get better pack luck to me we pack 82 gomez which is not bad for like sbcs or anything so if you guys did enjoy the video make sure you guys like the video if you did enjoy it's pretty much just how to get some cheap team of the year packs you guys can use to open up hopefully pack someone good um if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to like subscribe put turn on post notifications comment down below who you guys do pack from these packs um the attackers midfielders and defenders weekly objectives thank you guys for watching this video go check out some other ones uh subscribe the buttons on the screen right there check out some other videos on the screen right now thank you guys for watching and peace